Let's say for me to when we say they plus TV Africa hand, it shows a terrorist group, Boko Haram. We don't talk before say they want about two million euros. Why we say it be like eight hundred million naira to take release the Christian Association of Niger Chemo, Reverend Lawan and Dimi inside Michika local government area of Adamawa State. Can't be don't agree before say they go pay fifty million naira give the joint body to secure and release. But the joint body not agree before they kill him on Monday. Our talk talk person, Amadou Ye, he gets the report. The mother of Reverend Lawan Andimi came as a shock to many Christian faithful in Adamawa State. While those close to Reverend Andimi continue to mourn, some say his death is reflective of the security situation in the Northeast. This is a result of the insecurity that we have in our country and particularly in the Northeast. Impressions have been created and is being given to people that Boko Haram has completely been defeated, which is not true. Reverend Andimi was abducted by terrorist group Boko Haram as they invaded Michika in Adamawa State in search of foodstuff and petroleum products. Information available says the group had demanded over 2 million euros, about 800 million naira for his release. Pastor Lawan was uh, uh, abducted by the members of the Boko Haram over two weeks ago. And they threatened that they will kill him if two million euro was not given. But at the end of the day, actually they, it seemed that they were not really interested in, in money. They were really out to kill him. He was beheaded yesterday. Because last week, they called the wife on Thursday, and they told her that uh, they will be beheading him on Saturday. So they didn't do it on Saturday. They waited until Monday. And uh, LCCN pastor was also killed in Guerin by kidnappers, as if the two were actually planned because they happened the same day and probably close to almost the same time. And we wonder the kind of country we are living in. The Adamawa state government, while reacting to the execution, described the action of the terror group as barbaric. The governor is deeply saddened. Uh, it is really uh, lamentable that uh, the matter concerning uh, Reverend Lawan Andimi, uh, who is the can chairman of uh, Michika local government that was abducted, uh, has come to this uh, unfortunate uh, end. Uh, the governor sends his uh, sympathies and regrets to uh, the Christian community, particularly the Christian Association of Nigeria, and uh, the uh, Church of Brethren Mission, uh, EYN, uh, uh, particularly uh, the president, uh, Mr. Uh, Joel Billy. Today is a very, very sad day for uh, the governor, not only the governor, the entire people of Adama State. With peace finally returning to Michika community, residents will be hoping the federal government improves on the security situation. Amadin Ui, Plus TV Africa.